All right, we're taking a closer look at a Spec Ops uh, gun belt that is kind of set up with a couple items I threw on it to show you what you can do with it here. Uh, this one is a size large, so it's, uh, I think, from a size 42 waist on up to a 50, somewhere in that range. And it's really way too big on me, but we've got it adjusted down about as short as we can get it. And there's a whole lot of strap left over here. And it's just barely snug enough to work so we're just kind of getting by with it here to show you just got a blade tech holster mounted on it uh, got an ATS small med pouch a, uh, eagle evidence pouch Blade Tech single AR mount pouch there. A Blade Tech dual pistol uh, magazine pouch mounted on the side right there. And it's Velcro on the ender side. So it Velcros on the sides here and keeps the pouches from wiggling around on you. And then they give you these little straps you can put over it for a little bit extra support to, in case there's a lot of weight so it doesn't drag the outer belt off of the inner belt. Just wanted to give you a look at kind of how it looked uh, all set up with gear. Alright, a couple of the things I like about this Spec Ops belt are the fact that it's kind of uh, thin, uh, somewhat flexible, uh, it's pretty lightweight. Uh, a couple of things that uh, I don't like about it are uh, it's a little bit of a kind of a pain to assemble everything. You have to pull all these little snapped keepers off of it pretty much strip the whole velcro outer belt off to set up all your pouches and then put it all back together and kind of try to line the belt up again uh, if you want to adjust the pouch it's a little bit harder to do that but not that big a deal once you get them set up where you want them it's uh, pretty sturdy and it keeps them held pretty originally in place uh, as you can see I've got this set up uh, being left-handed uh, it seems to work out pretty good no issues or anything against that I mean it's just a belt but uh, it does have kind of a riggers belt style it has a little like plastic buckle here no telling how long the buckle will hold up but we'll see how that holds up for us uh, it's kind of a little bit of a pain to put this on if you had a lot more weight I could see it being a lot bigger problem trying to put this around and then feed a belt through it pulling it tight, holding it, feeding it back through there, doing something with the remainder of the strap. Uh, if it had a click together buckle, it would be a lot easier to use. You could just put it around your waist, click the buckle together, and be done with it. 